The follicular phase is the time in an ovulatory cycle um, that is marked by the beginning of menses or your period. This is the time when the uterus, under the control of various hormones, but especially estrogen, begins to grow and to thicken and to create a nutrient-rich lining inside there that will host a pregnancy if, if this occurs. During this phase, the follicles within the ovaries, they contain immature eggs. And under the control of estrogen, a group of these follicles begin to mature and it's as if they're in a race because the one that can mature the egg or the ovum from within the follicle will be the one at the time of ovulation to be released and that is the egg that can possibly become fertilized to achieve a pregnancy and that occurs approximately mid-cycle in the ovulatory cycle so approximately day 15 or 14 or 15. Sometimes this can vary from day 10 to 17 depending on the length of a woman's cycle because no two of us are exactly the same. So the healthiest, most mature egg is the one that's gonna be released at the time of ovulation. And as for the other eggs that were part of the race trying to mature to be that winner, when they're not, they become reabsorbed by the by the body and they will lose their chance to ever become a fully mature egg or be fertilized to go on and achieve a pregnancy. Other hormones are released um, toward the end of the follicular phase, specifically testosterone. And oftentimes as women, we think of testosterone being a male hormone, but we also have levels of testosterone. And under the influence of this increase in testosterone, um, women will experience increased vaginal lubrication, they'll in experience increased sexual desire, um, and this is nature's way of helping us to time sex to be able to achieve a pregnancy.